for me, digital humanities is a, an opportunity and a space to do uh, the kinds of research that I enjoy doing. And, you know, I think it's really a luxury that I can combine uh, interest in, in text and literature with um, computational methods, which is, I can't imagine something that I'd prefer doing. So, you know, that, that's the space that allows that and doing it with um, collaborators that I, I admire and respect. Digital Humanities started as being the application of computing to humanities uh, research and pedagogical problems, though it also played a very important role in administration that sometimes gets sort of forgotten administration of information and, and so on. And what's really interesting in the shift to digital humanities from humanities computing is we're seeing more and more humanities theoretical frameworks and perspectives being applied to computing. And then what's really nice and this sort of dialectic is the combination is this movement back and forth between the two. And I, I think that's one of the things that we're, we've been trying to do in projects like Hermeneutica, is a dialogue between these two traditions. The digital humanities, for me, is about bringing digital methodologies to bear on hum not just humanities data, but on humanities methods of thinking. How can we further enact those methods? What can we add to our methodological toolkit as hermeneuticists, as philologists, as historians from these new digital media? I think it's a set of tools uh, that has helped define a field and the field has helped, I guess, shape some of the tools that we use in digital humanities. So I don't think that there's a, a good way to sort of bifurcate those two things. Uh, you can't talk about one without actually talking about the other. Humanities itself were changing a lot. And I think that digital humanities is an expression we will use about 20 years, maybe. <laughs> and then the humanities will be entirely digitized. So probably we will speak again about humanities, but evidently digitized. In the past, I would have said that digital humanities is scholars pursuing knowledge with digital methods. Uh, now I think it's more radical than something like that. I think digital humanities is a whole ecosystem. Those methods and that pursuit of knowledge through the digital really changes the types of questions that can be asked and how we express our knowledge. And when we're expressing knowledge, going after different questions, suddenly I think scholarship becomes a whole different thing with all sorts of possibilities that previous scholars maybe thought of in the back of their minds but could never really pursue, so they never pursued it.